everybody's off to the domino renewal ceremony? <laughs> yep. Although, I don't think Stella was entirely happy with their outfits. I'm happy they went. It's a big day for Bloom. <gasps> oh! The Sirenix book! You have only one more test to gain the gem of courage. Find the Yellow Reef and snatch courage from its jaws. The Yellow Reef? There are over a hundred Yellow Reefs in the Magic Dimension. Find the Gem of Courage. Time is running out. Oh man, if we don't finish this quest in the next two days, then we can say goodbye to our powers forever. We need help. And I know just who to ask. Sirenix Box. Guardian of Sirenix, please help. What can I do for you, Tecna? Guardian, we need to figure out which yellow reef holds the gem of courage. Look for the yellow reef on a world that was saved by a single act of courage. <gasps> Domino! Bloom's home planet! Sky's bravery saved it! Let's pinpoint the location of that yellow reef. Still worrying about Daphne? I'm sure she's proud of you today. You're receiving a great honor, Bloom. You're receiving the bigger honor, Sky. Me? Why? You saved Domino. You brought magic back here. I did? You did. With this. You were able to pull the royal sword from its stone. You saved me and brought the kingdom back to life. I don't remember that guy. He's so fearless. You were that guy, Sky, and you still are. Okay, Bloom. <laughs> now come on, my parents are waiting. I don't remember them either. Tell you the source of Sirenic's monster. This is getting us nowhere. Ugh, she's never gonna spill. I know how to break her. <laughs> Isn't today Domino's renewal celebration? I bet your parents will be all dressed up with nowhere to run. <laughs> no! <laughs> I thought that might hit a nerve. <laughs> and it did. Go to Domino! Capture Oratel and Marion. Then she'll tell us what we want to know. Maybe I'll see you there. I've got a little hunting to do. Still not right. Stella! You've already made us change twice. We just all need a little something more. Oh! Since we're celebrating Domino's return to life, what about... <laughs> Flowers! Wow, Stella, how beautiful! Now we are perfect! Let's go! Your father will talk, and then introduce Sky, who can tell everyone about saving the sword. You can do it. Remember, you're that guy. Right. I'm that guy. Your Majesties. You guys look great! Do I detect the Stella touch? Well, of course. Hey, good news! We found the location of the Gem of Courage. Yeah, it's on Domino. And you guys are going to have to move fast. We'll back you up from here. The last gem and the last test. We've got to go! Now! Oh. Bloom, what do you want to do? There's only one thing I can do. Bloom, what's the matter? It's the Sirenix quest. I have to go. Go. Sky will cover for you. Huh? Oh, boy. 
Thanks. I'll be back as soon as I can. So... The Domino Gatekeeper is the only one of us Tritanus has not attacked. Yes, Serena is in danger. We must protect her. What is that? This is, and who it belongs to. Serena? Oh, no! Serena? <gasps> I'm here. It's just us. Don't worry. I I've been watching for Tritanus. We will all fight to keep you safe. You little rodents think you can fight me? Don't make me laugh! No! Ah, Serena. I've been looking for you. You will not enter the oceans of Domino! No! Such a special day for Domino. Let's make sure nobody enjoys it. Hurry up, beasts! I must follow him. I must stop him. The yellow reef should be right below us. All we have to do is snatch courage from its jaws. You know, I'm hoping that's just colorful language. It's a test of courage, Stella, but I know we can face whatever is down there. And complete the quest for Cyrenix. Magic, magic Wings!
We all owe a great debt to this brave young man. Oh, thanks. Thanks a lot. Without his courage, our world would still be frozen in ice. And what's wrong with ice? This way! Guards, seize the intruders! Tornado force! I'll take care of the guards. Dark chaos! Get Mama and Papa Bloom. Save us all some time and surrender. Aw, uh -huh. mm. you've got nowhere to go. The Great Yellow Reef. It's beautiful. Some of the rarest fish in the Magic Dimension live here. The reef is their home. That's great for the fish, but remember, there's something here with jaws. So that means be ready. I'm always ready. Tritanus' pollution! Watch out! The coral is changing! Let's get out of here! We had pretty good fights in our day, Marion. We certainly did, Oratel. Still have it in you? Always. <laughs> the sword of Domino. Here you go, love. <laughs> Draw your sword. Yes, sir. But before we start, King Oratel, I think you should know that I really don't remember how to use a sword. Sky, dear. There's a time for talk, and there's a time for action. That's right. Now let's do this. Well, here goes nothing. Better do something soon, Blue. Blast! Or we're gonna be pin cushions. I'm gonna blast it! Not good. It's just trying to defend itself. You guys, try to find the source of this sludge. Ow! Uh, hurry! Bloom! Over here! Good work, Serena. Now, let's take a look and see what we've got. Oh, no! Huh? <laughs> Fire blade! Jim would be harder to watch out. You little girls are nothing compared to your ancestors. Oh, these geezers are tough. They care about each other. So let's make them pay for it. your sword, or your favorite king gets a lightning bolt to the head. Do as she says, Marion. <sighs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Net of darkness. <sighs> Looks like your precious queen is sort of tied up. <laughs> so what are you gonna do <sighs> now, Kingy Poo? Marion, I'm coming! Sir 
Master! Freeze into the statue of ice! It's after Bloom! Dazzling Spirals! My spell didn't affect it. Not good. Let me try. Thirteen fail! Mine either. Maybe it's not real. Let's find out. Bloom! This way! Green growth! Ugh. I think it's some kind of guardian creature that protects the Gem of Courage. So to get the gem, maybe we have to prove that we're brave enough. And how do we do that? There's only one way. Snatch courage from its jaws! Bloom, this is no time to be reckless! Did you earn it? Wow. Fantastic. Oh, wow, it's amazing. I well, just love it. it. We have all three gems. Our quest is over. Whoa. <gasps> they did it. They found the last gem. Woohoo! <laughs> oh no! Let them go! Or you'll what? <laughs> or he'll fall down, I guess. Let's get Tritanus on the line. We have Daphne's parents here, but they're a little chillier than she might remember. <laughs> <laughs> uh, tell me how to gain Cyrenics, or watch your parents be destroyed! Burr... Please, no! Speak! If I push her over, do you think she'll break? Please don't hurt them! No, please don't! No! I'll tell you what you want to know! Good work, Icy. Hurry back! Tritanus has Daphne. So, we're done? Let's destroy them anyway. I'll say. <laughs> <laughs> no! <sighs> huh? <sighs> Bad move, Blondie. Actually, I thought it was a great move. Aw, oh, man, look who showed up. <gasps> My parents! Yep, we froze them solid. I'm fine, Bloom. And I realize I will always be fine as long as I have you. I feel the same way. You are that guy. I guess I am. <laughs> Watch out! We got what we came for. But how are we going to restore your parents? Easy. We're going to do it together. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Mom! Dad! Oh, thank you, Sky. I'm so happy you're okay. That was a close thank call. Goodness. I think this is yours. What is it? Hello, Sky. Oh, well, um, Bloom. Um, well, you see. Huh? I remember! <laughs> I remember everything! Bloom, this is for you. Oh, Sky! <laughs> oh, Sky, I'm so happy. Oh, no. Bloom. Sky, what's wrong? Tritanus has taken Daphne prisoner, and he's forced her to tell him the secret of Cyrenix. Oh no! We'll find her, Bloom. We're with you. We'll find her, wherever she is, and save her. Count on it! So icy. What do you think? Nice, huh? Hmm, very nice. We just have to get the other two seals. Next stop, the Pillar of Balance! You heard the man! Oh, man! We've got to steal more seals? And wreak more havoc. Sounds good. What's not to like? What's that? It's just a fish. A big fish. A really big fish. <gasps> hey! Did you see that? That thing just tried to eat me! It's coming back! Not the smartest form of seafood. Sisters! Blizzard! Lightning bolt! Dark spell! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> That'll teach it to mess with... <gasps> It's unstoppable. It will eat anything in its path. I'll say. Its fin is its weak spot. But now I control it. <laughs> See? <laughs> you know, Tritanus, that thing could really ruin somebody's day. Which gives me an idea. The, the Selkies. Selkies! That will take care of those little rats. Yes. Go! Find every Selkie you can and devour it! <laughs> <laughs> Start at the Pillar of Light. Oh. I must warn them. I must warn Bloom. We have training with Coda Torta today. 
He's supposed to be the best battle master around. I wish I could be there. The Sovereign's Council is just as important. It may be more important. The fate of the magic dimension is at stake. My parents have invited the sovereigns of all the realms to Domino. And as royal princesses, you three must be there. Which raises the big question. How will the magic dimension deal with Tritanus? Will the realms unite to fight him? Um, huh? Or will each kingdom try to go it alone? What? No, the really big question. What do we wear to this gala? It's not a gala, Stella. It's a political summit and war council. Right. Which makes me think... Fierce! <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Maybe a little too fierce, Stella. Looks like it. Much better. Eh, old school. No, classic. Thanks, Flora. Now, let's get politicking. Kings, queens, members of the royal courts, welcome to Domino. I declare the Sovereign's Council is now in session. You need to stay focused, Sky. First, we ask you to welcome two who we all thought were lost. Crown Prince Nereus and Princess Tressa of the underwater kingdom of Andros. My sister and I thank our cousin, Princess Aisha, and her friends, Princesses Bloom and Stella, for rescuing us. My fellow sovereigns, we must determine how to face the gravest threat to the magic dimension since the ancestral witches, Tritanus. Oratel and I believe that the only way to defeat him is for all the kingdoms to unite and fight together. Why should we unite? Erecleon is more than capable of defending itself. Oh. Zenith is also most effective when acting on its own. But can any of us alone really hope to defeat Tritanus? Solaria needs no one's help to destroy that monster. Oh, Daddy. Ready? Go! Whee! Yay! What? <gasps>
guys. We weren't expecting to see you. We're supposed to be training with Kota Torta. So what are you doing here? You'll see. Hello, Winx. We're here to make sure that doesn't get away. Uh-oh. But that's not a regular dragon. Nope. It's a wild one. A savage dragon. Savage? Totally untamed. Specialists, take up your cordon, if you please. Now, girls, as you can see, this is a wild creature. It is not evil, but it will follow its instincts. And its instincts are to fly away as fast as it can and incinerate you if you get in the way. Your job is to use your Sirenic's powers to control it. Good luck. Oh, dear. Well, here goes nothing. Winx, transform! Magic Winx, Sirenic! and Marion are right. We must unite to beat Tritanus. You don't understand, my beautiful daughter. You are so young. I may be young, but I am also Princess of Solaria and its guardian fairy. I know what I'm talking about. I have fought Tritanus. I'm very proud of you, Stella. Your courage brings honor to our house. Then please, just Think about what I'm saying. I will, Princess of Solaria. I will. Hey, Sky. I'm glad you could get away. Me too. But Diaspora is really hard to shake. Especially now that my father appointed her king's special liaison. You know, she's trying to come between us. Never gonna happen. I'm yours. Do you mean that, Sky? One hundred percent. Because that's how I feel, too. Prince Sky! <sighs> King Erendor requests your presence in the council chamber, your highness. <sighs> Thank you, King's liaison. Thank you, your highness. Look, Bloom, take my advice and give it up before Sky completely ditches you. That's Princess Bloom to you, Diaspora. Oh, and you'll never get between me and Sky, so stop trying. That's what you think, Princess Bloom. Bloom, can you hear me, Bloom? Daphne? <gasps> Tritanus is 
is leaving, I can reach Bloom. Bloom, the Selkies are in danger. Danger? What kind of danger? A monster. A monster to devour them. Where, Daphne? Near the Pillar of Light. Daphne? Daphne! Daphne! Let us discuss more. We can't leave now. Okay. So we've tried singing to it, reasoning with it, feeding it. Dragons must be meat eaters. Yeah, the Feast of Flowers totally didn't work. Don't forget being nice to it! That's right, laugh it up! So what's next? I think it might be the mustaches. She's delirious. No, look! It won't let anyone touch those tendrils by its mouth. Very observant, Flora. If I get in close, I think I can grab them. We'll distract it. Over here! Yoo-hoo! Dragon! Split off! Uh, got it! Come on, you guys! Yay, Musa! Wait a go! That's my girl! Nice work! Now, what have you learned? Every creature has a weak spot. And? Once you find it, you can control them. Anything else? Dragons... Don't eat flowers? <laughs> <laughs> oh! Well, hi there, Bloom. What's going on? The Selkies are in danger. Bloom said that the Selkies were near the Pillar of Light. We've got to move fast. I hope they're okay. It knows we're in here, and it's not going away. What are we going to do? When I give the signal, blast that pile of rocks! Okay, we can do that! Now? Not yet. Look! 
It's leaking pollution! Tritanus! He sent it after the Selkies! We have to find its weak spot! Genesis Glow! Give it everything you've got, because that is one big fish. Petal Hurricane! Genesis Blow! Deafening Corn! We must attack now! We must free our parents! But you will fail. We must unite together! Form an alliance with one army to defeat Tritanus. Solaria will join with you, if the other kingdoms do as well. What say you, Erendor? No. Arachleon will defend itself. Zenith will as well. How can I join an alliance that doesn't exist? Solaria too will defend itself. Oh, it's all falling apart. What do we do now? Oh, Sky, please reason with your father. I'll try, Bloom. But once he's made up his mind, it's really hard to change it. Sky is Crown Prince of Arachleon. He must fulfill his duty and follow his father's lead. Nobody asked your opinion, Diaspero. Whatever. Your father's asking for you, Prince Sky. and her annoying sister Daphne once and for all. But how? They keep defeating us. You said it, sister. Not this time. I've got it all figured out. Hey, what's in there? It's what we're going to use to wipe out those fairies, and the rest of Domino, too. Isn't it a beautiful day? <laughs> it's a perfect day for a party. Daphne's welcome home party! <laughs> Daphne? Daphne? Mm. Oh man, are you all right? I just keep forgetting. It hasn't been that long. You'll get used to being corporeal again. Thanks, Bloom. We were just talking about your party. We've invited the entire kingdom. And every king, queen, prince, and princess in the magic dimension. And all the Winx and specialists. I've asked Musa to DJ, and the Winx Club Band will play, and it's all just for you. It is going to be awesome. Hmm. <laughs> <gasps> oh. Whoa! I'm sorry, excuse me. Uh, 
I just don't understand what is going on with her. I think I do. I'll go talk to her. Oh, so what's in there? <laughs> the beast of the depths, the only thing in the magic dimension stronger than the dragon flame. Once it is roused, nothing can stop it. I see. Are you sure this is a good idea? It's a genius idea. We're going to send that thing after Daphne, and Bloom and the Winx will destroy themselves trying to save her. Let's give the old beastie a wake-up call. Beast of the depths, I summon you! <laughs> By the power of Dark Sirenix, I command you! Come on, you two! By, By the power of Dark Sirenix! I'm your sister, and I love you. Tell me what's wrong. Oh, Bloom. I just didn't think it would be so hard. You mean to return to life? I'm sure you'll stop bumping into things soon. That's it, isn't it? I'm just not myself, not the old Daphne. No, you're a new Daphne. The real, live Daphne! But I think I've lost my powers. I am the nymph of Domino. I must defend this kingdom and its people. What if something happens? What if I can't? You still have your Cyrenix powers. You just need to have confidence in yourself. And nothing is going to happen. <gasps> Nothing except for a great big party for you. Now come on! <laughs> wow. Sky, I'm so happy you're here. <laughs> it's been a while since we just hung out. Oh! Whoa! Uh. Yeah! Oh. Wow! Uh. Oh, 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 Sorry! Man. Uh. Yes! Oh. Not again! Oh. Oh. Awkward. Mm. Daphne, don't worry. You'll... I know, I know. I'll get used to being corporeal soon. Hey, you guys! Look! Whoa. Look! I guess it's time for a party. That's awesome! Oh. Bring on the music. Whoa, cool. Yeah, let's jam. Wow. <sighs> wow, Daphne, your parents are really going all out to welcome you back. Yes, it's too much. It's going to be wonderful. There's going to be music and dancing and so many people who want to welcome you home. <gasps> Music, dancing, people. Music, dancing, people. Oh, oh Daphne. Oh. Oh. You know, sweetie, that 90s muffler has got to go. You need a, a makeover. makeover. And now for a new you. But I like the old me. Don't fight, you can't win. <laughs> How can you possibly dance in that thing? Dance? Me? Stay calm. Now, this is your left foot. And this is your right foot. Musa, on it. Uh. That's awesome! Okay, Daphne, just keep your eyes on me and do what I do! Woohoo! 
move! And right and left, and turn and shake, and one and two. The problem with this look is it's dreary. She needs something totally different. Uh -huh. And one Whoa. and two, and oh. one and two, yeah. and turn and shake. Okay, Whoa. this is your new cell. It's pre-programmed, internet enabled, and magic compatible. <laughs> Oh, whoa! And you won't believe the apps! Whoa! Hmm, I've got it! <gasps> oh. Yeah! Oh, Daphne! It's a whole new you! Your Majesties, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Princess Daphne of Domino. Yeah! 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 That's my sister! Yeah! Daphne! Yeah! Daphne! Yeah! Daphne! I'm so happy to be home again, and I can't wait to get to know all of you. Princess Daphne, welcome home. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Thank you. Welcome home, Princess Daphne. <laughs> <laughs> the tricks! Hello, Daphne. Looks like a party, and you didn't invite us. Oh, no! Oh. But we brought you a present anyway. Protect Daphne. Right. Yes, let's go. Oh, Bloom. Back, witch. Dad, get her inside. We'll hold it off. The doors. Help me. Push. Bloom, Weeks, come on. 
One person can control the Beast of the Depths. The Nymph of Domino! Me! But I can't! I lost my powers and I can't! <laughs> Mom! I know Daphne hasn't lost her powers. She just needs to have confidence in herself again. We have to find a way to help her. And send that beast back to where it came from. And for that, we're going to need help ourselves. Guardians of Cyrenix, we need your help! We are all here, Winx. How can we help you? It's Daphne, Guardian. We must help her regain her Cyrenix powers. Ah. There is only one way to restore Daphne's confidence in her powers. The inspiration of Cyrenix. But where do we find it? The source. The source? In Lake Rocaluche, where we first got Cyrenix. <laughs> Going. Wherever it is, we're going too, sisters! We're here! Lake Rocaluche! of Cyrenix could be? And what does it even look like? I don't know, but we have to find it. Split up and look around. Find anything? You are not alone. We will find it! Together! We can do anything! We are the Winx! I think I get it now! We are the Source! Together we can inspire Daphne! Go help Daphne! You're the ones who need help! Ice Storm! Blast of Darkness! Dark Lightning! Winx, come together! Later. 
Steady! Steady! Oratel! Where is Daphne? I will not endanger my kingdom, my friends, my family any longer. Beast of the Depths! I am here! Go away, Bloom! You'll get hurt! Let the beast take me! No way! Never going to happen, Daphne. All together, Winx! Oh. You can do it, Daphne! Yes! Don't be afraid. Trust your powers. Believe in yourself. Watch out! No! Oh, no! Bloom! Daphne! Believe in yourself! Daphne! Nymph of Cyrenic! On the Winx Club, Daphne joins the Winx at Althea College, where she becomes the history of magic teacher. Meanwhile, at Cloud Tower, a mysterious new student introduces everyone to a magical book that can turn any story into a daunting reality. The challenges that face the Winx will be legendary. Join the dark side, huh? <laughs> it's in your best interest. I know how to get to Bloom. Hmm. <laughs> Selena, I bet that book of yours could get us to Bloom faster. <laughs> yes, I have got the perfect story. Under the Palace of Domino is the Vortex of Flames. Its magic is so fierce. Not even Bloom could stand up to it. Really? A burning pit? Ugh, boring. That's too bad, because the Vortex of Flames is also home to the Fire Eaters. Ooh, now you're talking. We'll fight fire with fire. Funny you should mention Domino, because I just got invited to an exclusive ceremony there. You won't find a better connection than that. Hmm. 
little party, find a way to destroy Bloom, and then maybe you'll have a future with us. Hmm. Oh, Daphne, I'm so happy for you. You are finally becoming Crown Princess today. You deserve it. Thanks, Bloom. I'm just a little nervous. Oh, Daphne, don't worry. We're in this together, right? You're right. I like that. So, now where is everybody? Hmm, good question. I'll check. Bloom, any sign of them? Yep, there they are. Hey, Sky, does Bloom ever talk to you about Daphne? Like, whether or not she's ever mentioned me? Huh? What? Sky, Thorin, we're up here! Oh, hey, Bloom! I was just talking about you guys with Sky. Uh, trying to, at least. Wait, what? Man, you are out of it today. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, I have to go. Huh. Huh. huh, I wonder what that was all about. Dragon flame. Are you okay? Here, let me help you. Thanks, Flora. I'm okay. You sure? Let's get you some water. <laughs> Come on, Bloom. Let's see what the girls are up to. What have we missed? You are just in time. I'm feeling inspired. There's nothing better than a royal coronation. It's so official. Uh, hold on a sec, Kiko. In honor of today's special occasion, we need to take our looks up a notch. Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> oh, Stella. Oh, Stella. <sighs> hold on, Winx. Fix it. Um, uh, yeah. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh, cool! Wow. Fancy. That's more like it. Okay, Daphne, your turn. Now, what color story am I getting from you? Vibrant greens, royal purples. I got it. <laughs> oh, Kiko, aren't you just the prettiest little thing? Seriously, you put the rest of us to shame, your highness. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> Am I good or what? I'm impressed, Stella. I feel like true royalty. Someone can't take their eyes off you. Princess Daphne. <laughs> Citizens of Domino. Royals. Dignitaries. Kiko, what's going on? Thank you for joining us on this special day. It is our honor to have you in Diaspora? Her again? Who invited her? Come on, let's tell the others. Good idea, Lockett. As King of Domino, I'm proud to bestow upon my oldest daughter Daphne the title of Crown Princess. <laughs> this belongs to you now. Wear it with honor. I'm so proud of you, darling. I promise to do my best for Domino and for its people. Princess, 
May I have this dance? I love seeing Daphne so happy. Yeah, she looks great, Bloom, but I'm not thrilled about her hanging with Doran. Why? What's wrong with him, Skye? You need to know what kind of guy he is. Before Red Fountain, when we were kids, Thorne and I went to school together. One day, we were out in the woods of Arachleon looking for animal tracks. Then, out of nowhere, we were attacked. In the middle of the fight, he just left me there. Without him there, I barely escaped. Sky, I had no idea. I didn't mean to bring you down. I just wanted you to know. Come on, let's show these worlds how it's done. <laughs> <laughs> Domino is lucky to have such poised young princesses. Indeed, we couldn't ask for two kinder or braver young women. This is all so romantic! Kiko, she's up to no good. Not to worry, time to take action! Now! Thank you, thank you, <laughs> thank you everyone for joining us on this special day. herself these days. Perfect. We have ourselves an easy target, ladies. Oh, do tell. Bloom is so weak, she can't even talk. Oh, goody. Sounds like the perfect time to spark things up a bit. This is gonna rock. Bring on those fire eater things. You got it. In the vortex of flames live the Fire Eaters. Legendarium! Fire Eaters, rise from the vortex! I invoke you! May your sparks ignite the terror that you so crave! Bloom! Bloom, can you hear me? Everything's gonna be okay. I'm right here. Oh, Sky. Daphne, what's wrong with her? Oh. It's the dragon flame. She doesn't have enough left to sustain her. Oh, no! We had no idea. Winx, it's not your fault. Bloom wanted to help. Skye, why don't you take her to her room? You need to get some rest, Bloom. Huh? Huh? <gasps> I don't think they were on the guest list. What are they? Fire Eaters. They're part of an old Domino legend. Uh, stay away from her! Sky, you can't let them near Bloom! Daphne! Nymph of Cyrenix! It's up to us now! Magic Winks! Bloom it! Aisha!
good. Sky, hurry! You've got to get Bloom out of here now! <laughs> Round two, Winks! I've got you, Sky! Keep going! Stop! What? Huh? Where are you going? Let us go ahead, Diaspro. The monsters took over the whole northern area of the palace. The Vortex of Flames is the only place where Bloom can restore her power. Do you buy that, Sky? No. You would never help Bloom. Now get out of our way! <laughs> Don't worry, Thorin. I can handle this guy. Gem Lesser! Uh, that was just too much work. We need to get Bloom's power back, and fast! Only she can stop these things. Quick, grab Bloom and leave Sky here. What now? This way. Come on! Let's go! <laughs> Don't even think about it. Yeah! Finally, Bloom will be history, and Sky will be all mine. I command you! Back! Hurry, run! We'll hold them off! Where are the girls? If they're together, they'll be fine. What? Where did everybody go? Oh no! The Vortex of Flames! never get the hint that it's time to leave. Their extreme durability is legendary. Oh, great. Just skip to the part where you tell us how to beat them. Legend says that only the power of the Vortex of Flames can defeat them. Daphne! Bloom's in danger! Protection of waves! I think Thorin and Diaspro are taking Bloom to the Vortex right now. Historically, the Vortex was a magical place to test the Dragon Flame. That doesn't sound so bad. But after so many centuries, the power of the Vortex has grown uncontrollable. Bloom is too weak to handle it. That can't be good. Daphne, we've got these guys. You and Sky go after Bloom. <sighs> Here we are. Isn't it breathtaking? Now just place Bloom right into the vortex of flames. The rest will take care of itself. Down there? Are you sure? She's the fairy of the dragon flame. Therefore, fire is good for her. It's not that complicated. Huh? Well, you want her to get her powers back, don't you? Thorin, no! <gasps> Don't do it, Thorin! Don't listen to Diaspro! You are one wicked girl! This is me on a good day. No! Ah. Oh, Sky! Yeah. Bloom, what are you doing to her? <laughs> Diaspro! Don't you dare! Give it up, Sky! You're too good for her anyway. You give it up, Diaspro! You know I love Bloom! <sighs> well, I hope you can deal with this then. <laughs> no! <laughs> Bloom! Sky! Gotcha! <laughs> There's nothing you can do now. <laughs> Whatever shall I do? Where did she go? Sky? Thorin? What was that? I've heard of this place. It's the vortex of flames. It's incredible! It's so beautiful!
You can do this! To stick together. I know. I won't let you down again. I promise. Huh? <gasps> Bloom! Flame Storm! Ha ha! Sweet! She must have passed the test of the vortex. Bloom! Am I happy to see you? I'm so happy to see you too, Sky. Now let's get these monsters. We have to hurry. They're all over the place. Let's go. I don't know how much more of this I can take. Ugh. I know, but we have to keep going. That's right, Aisha, but you've got one more to help you. so scared that day when we were kids. I am truly sorry. No sweat, Thorn. We both had some growing up to do. Truce? Truce. Oh, how I wish there was a handsome prince to dance with. Yes, wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> Thorin, maybe there's someone special you'd like to dance with. This is magic what you've given me. No matter what steps we take, there's a bond you cannot break. So let's keep dancing. Take my hand. Oh, I'm so happy for Bloom and Sky. They look so in love with each other. initial test. <laughs> but you still need to prove your rank among the witches of Cloud Tower. Yeah, let's see what you can do with your attack spells. <laughs> Gravity destabilizer! Oh! 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 Ah! Ah! Next time, try aiming. <laughs> Seriously, I'm getting dizzy just watching. Whoa, sisters, turn your attention to that one. Now! And that one. Now that's more like it. They learn from the best. Well 
done. You two are ruthless. The both of you could teach those other pathetic witches a thing or two. Trix, I've got the winks in view. They're headed this way. Uh, uh, dismissed. Oh, quick! Tidy up the place. Company's on its way. <laughs> if they lock the Legendarium, I won't be able to free Asheron. No way are they getting into Cloud Tower. Leave it to the Witch of Illusions. <laughs> <laughs> Winks, finally the moment we've been waiting for. With this key, we'll end the threat of the Legendarium forever. Wait, something is off. Look! Cloud Tower, it's gone! Wait, no, it's just invisible. I can sense its negative magic. It's more than invisible. Not even my identification magic can find it. Hmm. Am I the only one concerned that there is an entire college packed with witches run by the tricks and we can't see it? Stella is right. Staying here is dangerous. We should go back to Althea. You did the right thing coming back here. But now, you don't even know where the Legendarium is. Lockett, don't make it worse. We need all hands on deck. Speaking of which... Where's Stella? In her boutique for some Stella time. So many choices. Hmm, not this one. Or that one. Let's see. You. Nah, let's try this one. Oh, who's there? One moment. I'm coming! Hey, is everything okay in here? Brandon, what are you doing here? Well, it's our anniversary. I was thinking we could go out today and celebrate. Our anniversary? Oh, is that today? <laughs> How could I forget? I say we go to Solaria. Oh, cool. Do you know a good restaurant there? I know the perfect place. Come on. There must be a way. What we need is an anti-invisibility spell. I know. Let's look for one in the Library of Solaria. The biggest library in the entire Magic Dimension. But its access is reserved for the King. So, how do you propose we get your father to give us access? Last I checked, he wasn't the most approachable man. That won't be a problem. I have a little surprise up my sleeve. Trust me. Today marks the rare occurrence when all three sons of Solaria are aligned in the sky. I'd like to welcome you all to this momentous occasion. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, and we're just in time. Let's greet this happy day with joy and camaraderie. And as tradition states, the King of Solaria relinquishes his powers for just one day. What is he talking about? and gives the regency and the throne to his own loving daughter. Doesn't that mean... Yep, I am queen for the day. <laughs> so, does this mean I have to call you your majesty? <laughs> Only every time you address me. Hooray! Stella. Stella. And all of you can be rest assured to advise Stella on her royal duties and practices will be her mother Luna and I standing by her side. We always knew she was a queen at heart. Welcome, Queen of Solaria. Hurrah for this Stella! This is going to be a glorious Hello, day. Solaria. We need a pick to remember this by. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Sweet! So, what do I do first? Well... Grant us access to the Royal Library, Your Majesty. 
Permission granted. Thank, Thank you, Your Highness. Your Highness. <laughs> Good luck, Winx. Oh, the Royal the Library. Library. I think I'll stay here with the Queen. There's nothing more beautiful than a Royal Library. And this one is you. Stay there, Winx. We'll bring the books to you. Now that's service. <laughs> it's just as I feared. Daphne, what's wrong? It looks like the trick sorcery can't be nullified by fairy magic. We have to find another solution. It says here that fairy magic must be enhanced with master technology. Great. You can handle that, right, Techna? Not alone. I'm gonna send all the data to Timmy. He can help me with the techno magic research. All right, books, back to your shelves. <laughs> Please step forward. You may approach the queen. Now the courtiers will make their requests. Your mother and I are here to help you. Your majesties, my queen. I'd like to fill the royal terraces with soil to turn them into vegetable gardens. That, that would be nice. That will not be allowed. I'll have to get back to you. Next, please approach the queen. Your majesties, my neighbor's dogs keep me up all night. I'd like a law forbidding post-sunset barking. Good Don't idea. Don't be silly. Oh, this is rough. Oh. My first decree is that courtiers come to me only with good news. Or with gifts. Huh? Stella, that is not the point of this tradition. Yes. This time I agree with your mother. See? That's good news. And with good news comes an even better party. Now let's have some fun. <laughs> I have a feeling she didn't quite read the Queen's job description. <laughs> Great. Now Little Miss Sunshine can add Queen to her bragging rights. Well, there's got to be a way to use this in our favor. Yes, let's use her authority to our advantage. Selena? I've got just the story for you. <laughs> Ew, I'm exhausted. Aren't you going to dance? Well, I... You're right. Dancing gets old. Time for something else. Party's over, people. Time to stop. Now what's next? I'm bored. Honey, maybe you should think about attending some assembly meetings or gathering together the rules. Don't be silly, Mom. I've got all day. Yoo-hoo, guardsmen. You are so out of fashion. Mm -hmm. huh? uh, uh. There you go. Turn, please. Oh! 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 That just won't work. Stella, I think you were missing the point. You're right. This tuxedo style is not sharp enough. Fashion redo. Stella, I was hoping we could have our anniversary date. But maybe not if you're going to act like Great this. Great idea. Dinner is served. What are you waiting for? Have a seat. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Isn't this great? Uh, sure, but I was actually hoping for something more private. Unbelievable! Oh. <gasps> How dare you insult my generosity! What's going on? I'll tell you, the power has officially gone to her head. I am so over this. I need me time. Everyone, clear out, please. 
I thought this was supposed to be fun. Hmm. I've got a good feeling about this one. Once upon a time, there was an evil queen who possessed a mystical magic mirror. Charm this little princess and then darken her heart. Oh, goody! I just love presents. Wow! Now that's the way to treat a queen. Uh, Hello, Stella, the most worthy queen of all the sovereigns of the magic world. Oh, finally! Someone is showing me the right kind of respect. It appears that my daughter has gotten carried away. How do I get Stella to behave like a true queen? As we know, Radius, it takes time to adjust. Be patient. We'll try to reason with her, Your Majesty. Uh, good luck with that. There! Hmm... No... There! That's much better! I wonder who sent this to me? What really matters is that you, above all, are the most beautiful queen in the entire magic dimension. Oh, stop! Don't go anywhere, Mirror. I have business to tend to. You have all deprived me of valuable time as queen. For that, you must be punished. That's enough, Stella. This act of yours has gone too far. You're right, Father. I will no longer ask you for advice. From now on, by royal command, you can no longer speak. <sighs> Stella, stop! That's Queen Stella to you, Blue. This is not the way a queen or a fairy acts. Fine. If you don't want to be my friends anymore, I'll find some new ones. Friends who understand me. My queen. Welcome, friends. Witches! Witches! Back off! These ladies shall be treated with the utmost respect. So much for reasoning with her. We'll just have to keep an eye on her for now. Oh, I'm going to get some rest. Witches, my friends, make yourselves at home. Now the real fun can begin. <laughs> so fairies, wanna play? <laughs> An invitation from the queen herself. Well done, Selina. Mm, I always wanted to visit the palace of Salaria, but I think I'm gonna need some legendary reinforcement. How about as a goddess? <laughs> Fabulous. I have a great idea. Hold on. I don't know why Stella brought you here, but you must respect her home. Huh. Let's see. What shall we turn you into? A pig? Hmm. Boring. <sighs> but funny. <laughs> Stop! No! What is she doing? <laughs> King Radius. You see your guards are in danger, and yet you cower in the corner? How dare you speak to the king like that? That's enough! And just what are you going to do about it? What we always do! Save the day! Daphne! Nymph of Cyretics! Magic Winks! Lumix! Aisha! Fairy of Wax!
for everything blue. Oh, we will get your daughter back. Lilac Vortex! You don't stand a chance, witches! Come on! Help us fight the witches! We can't. By the Queen's command. At least defend King Radius and Luna. <laughs> Daphne! There's got to be a way to get these witches off our backs! <laughs> <laughs> Well, hey there, Queen Stella. Darcy. Welcome to Solaria. It's a pleasure having you here at the palace. Huh? Stella, watch out! What are you doing? Stop! As with all the witches here, Darcy is a guest of the Queen. Ah! The mirror! No! Uh. Oh no! Brandon! <laughs> what did you do to him? Get out of my palace! Sure thing. But I'll be taking this uh. with me. If you want it, you can find me in the Legendarium world. Uh. No! <laughs> Oh. I'll be right back, Brandon. I've got a crown to save. No, wait! Magic Links! Mythic! Phoenix. Stella, Fairy of the Shining Sun! Where am I? Amazing. I never realized the world of Solaria was linked to such an ancient and mythical place. I've got to go check this out. Welcome. I am Ariadne, the Keeper of the Labyrinth. What you seek lies inside. Very cool. You know, masks are so in this year. Oh, it's so dark down here. Hmm. Oh. Where am I? Maybe it's this way. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. Did I mention that I hate mazes? Ugh! What am I getting myself into? Oh dear. Come on, Stella. You need to get that crown back. Uh, well. Here, look. Uh, wait. What? <gasps> well, I bet you didn't see that one coming. <laughs> <gasps> Like someone else wants your crown. Bright star.
this for you, you oversized bull! You chose the wrong queen to mess with! Seriously, is that all you got? Oh, you ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> If you linger too long, you'll be stuck in the Legendarium world forever! <laughs> mm, catch me if you can! I've got you now! <laughs> Cat got your tongue! Good luck getting out of this maze. <laughs> bye bye, fairy. <laughs> huh? What? Which way do I go? Uh, if only I had the winks by my side. I was so cruel to them. What was I thinking? Uh. Oh, I knew you'd come to your senses. Fairy Godmother! Even when things feel twisted, you can always unravel the knot. Come again? It's a simple metaphor, my dear. Take this ball of yarn. Got it. Now what? Just follow the thread, Stella. Thank you, Fairy Godmother. <laughs> you can do it! Oh, I get it. Unravel the knot. Relief! I made it! <laughs> you may have been invited here, but you have overstayed your welcome. Aww, but we're having so much fun! Rise and shine! <laughs> I could do this for hours. Ready for it, Winx! That's enough! Maybe Solaria should rethink the whole queen for a day tradition. If only those guards could actually help us. Witches, you're not gonna win this one! This isn't over, Winks! What was that? Looks like a disappearing act to me! They're gone! Hold tight, your majesties! You've done it, Winks. Thank you. Now let's try to find Queen Stella. Easy does it, Brandon! I can help! Uh, maybe not. Uh. Hey, everyone! Uh. Look! Brandon! <laughs> oh, Brandon. I'm so totally over the top. Sorry. Wait, Stella. You were completely out of line all day today. That wasn't me. It was the mirror. It was you, Stella. And I have to be quite honest with you. I'm not sure I like the kind of person you've become. Brandon... I am... This isn't something you can uh, just queen your way out of. Uh, uh -huh. What? Brandon! I... I don't even want to be queen. Sounds like she's in there. Let me check. <gasps> Brandon, what's going on? I think you should ask Her Royal Highness. He was so upset. Just give Brandon some time, Stella. So I take it my parents are upset with me too? Something like that. They'll understand. There are clear traces of sorcery here. 
Being a queen is so much harder than I thought. I think the secret is to treat everyone as your equal. I've got to find a way to make it up to them. Especially Brandon. I was so awful to him. Don't worry, Stella. We'll help you. Count us in two! Thanks, Swinx. You guys mean the world to me. And so does Brandon. We've got this! <laughs> All we need are some fresh moves. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Whoa! A pretty spring aroma. <sighs> the right lighting. <sighs> and an apology straight from the heart. Let's do this right and make it a big party. Not just for Brandon, but for the whole royal court. I'll take care of the food. It's going to be perfect, Stella. When we're together, feels so right. It's a brand new day. And you know we got it right, so let's celebrate. When troubles get you down, put a smile on your face. And let the music have its way. It's a party. All we need is just a little time for ourselves. To go back to who we really are. And feel the joy of Way to ruin our plan. It's not over yet. Stella is still technically queen. Well, then what are we waiting for? Let's attack again. Now's the time to do it. While they play around in the kitchen. Tricks, I've got this. The sauce is almost ready. Here comes the dough. And some fresh cut veggies. You girls have been amazing. How do I even begin to thank you? You can start by giving us a hand. You got it, Bloom. What? Oh, Stella, didn't you learn not to run in the kitchen? Um, sorry. All right, to make a good pizza base... Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm following. Okay, maybe someone is a bit too excited. <laughs> huh? Huh? Oh, hello. Please, come in. What is going on in here? Keep going, Stella. You're doing great. A what? Hmm? <sighs> <laughs> Who said a queen can't get her hands dirty? <laughs> oh. Ooh, I just love throwing a party! Cherie, did you make the lemonade? Yep, here it is! Let me go! <laughs> <laughs> oh. ah! I already told you, I have no desire to see Stella right now. Huh? Whoa. 
now aren't you glad you came? <laughs> Welcome! Please, enjoy this dinner as a sign of my gratitude and appreciation for all of you. Here you go! <laughs> oh. <gasps> Anyone for pizza? romantic dinner for two, but I did make this pizza with my own hands. For you. You know, I have to say, it's good to have the old Stella back. I'm so sorry, Brandon. I was just awful to you. I realize now that we are all royalty at heart. <laughs> and everyone deserves to be treated that way. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I found the perfect entertainment for Stella's party. A rather ravenous guest. Legendarium, Gargantua, greedy giant. Go and feast yourself on that fairy festival and devour everything! Hot pizza right out of the oh. oven! Oh, oh. 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 wow, looks delicious! Gargantua is a legendary creature whose only goal is to eat whatever is around him. I have got to stop it! Take a breath, Stella. We need a plan first. A perfect party! Completely ruined! And I didn't even get to serve my giant cake! That's it! Pixies 
Party security. As my final act as queen, I want to apologize to everyone. And I want to thank my parents, Brandon, and my friends for their support. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, Dad, I realize that being a queen is a serious job which takes patience, humility, and a lot of love. Thanks for giving me the chance. Hooray! Yes! Oh, wonderful! Oh, 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 yes. <laughs> Thank you, Solaria! Oh. <sighs> Come on, everyone. Let's go! Oh, Stella, I'm sorry your date with Brandon was ruined. It's not your fault the rudest guest ever crashed our party. Whoa! Stella, Ugh. I've got an idea. Huh? So, Bloom never told you what this idea of hers was? She and the Lynx have been up to something, but I don't know what. The invitation said to come here. Welcome. Oh, Bloom, this looks wonderful. Please follow me to your table. I analyzed Bloom's best pizzas on the basis of taste, texture, ingredients, and I came up with 156 possible combinations. Uh, we'll just take the chef's special. Thanks, Techno. Happy anniversary, Brandon. Happy anniversary. <laughs> <sighs> you know, even after everything that just happened, I can honestly say I'm starving. Me too. <laughs> Let's eat. <laughs> <laughs> into the depths of Andros. This is the paradise of Andros. So strong, so filled with light. <laughs> Thanks to the suboceanic star, Gorgo. <laughs> Soon, the light of Gorgol shall be mine. <laughs> yes, 
My power is growing. This is child's play to me now. I require an ally. Ha! Ha! A predator suited to Andros. The Hunter of the Seas of Andros. I'll make it even more terrifying. Ha! <laughs> the oceans of Andros will be deprived of light and fall into darkness. <laughs> yes, your horrendousness, Valtor. It's a great plan and a war. <laughs> I was just about to leave for Andros. <laughs> Did I mention I'm... I'm not so good at swimming, your evilness. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, what do you say we call Callisto first? That star is super dry. Obscurum! <laughs> yes, my detestable lord. Goodbye. <laughs> been to space, and I've seen the stars. But on Andros, the sea is... Uh, is... Um, is... The sea is like space, and the people of Andros are the stars. Oh, right. <sighs> Your delivery was great, Aisha! Your family will be so proud of you. They'll be impressed for sure. If I manage to fix your dress, you keep moving around like an eel. Thanks, girls, but it's the anniversary of the founding of Andros. I want my speech to be, uh... Perfect? It will be. Let's just repeat it a few more times. Mm -hmm. <laughs> huh? Er, uh, one sec. It's next. <laughs> He's so cute. He's trying to support me every way he can. Ready? The people of Andros. Uh, next again. The people of Andros are flowers. Are what? I just realized your dress needs some flowers. Stella. The people of Andros... Uh, the people of Andros... Uh, Next is just being supportive. I know, but this is not helping. Sorry, girls. Mm -hmm. Uh... Hmm... I've been to space, I've seen the stars, huh? There you are. I just wanted to give you these. It'll be fine, relax. Don't get hung up on memorizing every word. Sorry, Nex, huh? but I need to be alone and focus. Uh. I've been to space, I've seen the stars. I've been to space, uh. I've seen the stars. Um. of time before darkness falls on Andros!
<sighs> Welcome, everyone. I'd like to thank my parents, King Terador and Queen Niobe, for trusting me with this. And also thank our special guests, Ligia, Queen of the Mermaids, and Durana, Queen of the Stars. Dear guests, <clears throat> I've been to space. I've seen the stars. Um, but here, on Andros... Uh, um, um, on Andros, the sea is... is... Um... Oh. What Ayesha is trying to say is that you all, the people of Andros, are... So special to us, isn't that right, Aisha? Today's anniversary is the beginning of a new age of peace. Legia and Dorana will combine their magic to protect Andros. Valtor has no chance against them together. When Valtor showed up, my brother Argan suddenly disappeared. <gasps> Did you know that? Therefore, I do not wish for anyone to feel the pain that I feel. Hmm? <gasps> this is Gorgol, star of Andros. It is a unique star that lights up the depths of the ocean. Valtor won't be able to resist the temptation to steal its light. But we won't allow this. Wonderful. Oh, hooray! Yeah! <laughs> awesome! Yes, yeah, that's <sighs> Yes. That barrier should make it impossible for Obscurum and the Star Yummies to approach. <gasps> no! Something's wrong! Too late! <gasps> oh, no! What's this? What's going on? What Impossible! Oh, Our barrier didn't hold! Twinkly, what's happening? <gasps> the barrier couldn't keep the star yummies away because they're already there! No, that can't be. If Gorkle falls, Andros will plunge into darkness. <gasps> That's not gonna happen, Aisha. We'll save Gorgol! Exactly! Yeah. And we shall all support you, Winx. Everyone ready? Uh, where's Twinkly? Twinkly, is everything okay? What's wrong? Well, it's just... <sighs> I can't... I can't swim! I can't come with you! Oh. You do have an important role here, Twinkly. If you came with us, then who would stay here and comfort the people of Andros? <gasps> Me? Right! You're the only one who can cheer them up. We're <gasps> counting on you. Sounds like you've got an opening on your team. Hmm. Don't worry, I'll make myself useful. Forget it, Nex. I can take care of myself. I know that. I want to stay by your side anyway. <clears throat> <clears throat> hmm. All right, girls. There's only one way down there. <clears throat> Winks. Cyrenix! Bloom, fairy of the dragon flame!
Vecna, fairy of technology. Could you please tell me what's wrong? It's nothing, really. I'm okay. <laughs> I know how important that speech was to you. <sighs> I wanted to impress my parents and make them proud of me, but I made a mess out of it. Trust me. We all understood how important it was to you. Anyone can get tongue-tied in a moment of stress. Just let the others help. Hey! Lovey-dovey! Huh? huh? Move it! What did you see, Bloom? I have the feeling someone's following us. I think I saw something strange, too. Hey, what are you waiting for? Come on! <sighs> Gorgol is wonderful. Oh, and it's under attack. We gotta do something now. Powers have no effect. Valtor, not again. Look out, Aisha. <laughs> Logic net. <laughs> Everyone, regroup. <sighs> We've got to get past that monster to reach Gorgle. Uh, hey, where's Nex? <laughs> hey, you! <laughs> Call off your creatures! Uh -huh. Challenge Obscurum!
your chance! Rapids! Work, girls. Woo! I'm glad that's over. <laughs> Is that all you can do? Coward! Is this how you fight? Huh? I'll never give up. Aisha needs me. I can't hold it. It's filled with dark magic. We gotta free it from Valtor's control. Right, but we can't do that without our cosmic's powers. For now, we'll just have to trap it somewhere. I'm going to lure it over to that cave. Get ready. Hey, beast! Come and get me! If you dare. down and chill for a bit. We'll free you after we save Gorgle. <laughs> we have to stop the star yummies before they escape with all the core's energy. Uh, huh? uh, Next! Uh, Morphix Barricade! Yeah! Uh, Thanks, Aisha. See? Teamwork never fails. You're right. Sorry I pushed you away before. I know you wanted to help, but I was too focused on not disappointing my parents and my people. Hmm. So... Power couple team up? I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> Light of Gorgal.
Nice save. I just acted on impulse. That's what I do best. <laughs> Light Diamond! Lotus Flower! No good. Sirenic's magic isn't stopping them. They all got away. No! This can't be happening. Don't worry. We'll find a way to fix everything. We have to save Andros before it's too late. We trust you, Aisha. You know Andros better than anyone else. Hmm. Finally feel the power. Cosmic's power is the only thing that can rekindle the core. But we can't breathe underwater if we use our Cosmic's transformation. Don't worry. We'll find another way. How hmm? cute! Uh, huh? Huh? <laughs> Obscure him! <laughs> now that the core is empty, nothing can stop me from obliterating it! What makes fun of Obscurum? Take this! Spring Banner! Logic Net! Doesn't look good. Time to go. Bye bye. What do you think he meant? No, it's not gonna be okay. The core is out, Obscurum escaped, and we're stuck in here. What kind of princess can't even protect her kingdom? Hey, what are they doing? Anemones? They're waking up. They're everywhere. Uh, oh, oh. They are so beautiful. Watch out, Stella! Huh? Ah! What was that? Sometimes anemones have a poison that can make you sleepy. 
Oh. Oh. I am so in the mood for nappy nappy oh. time. Anything uh, if I just close my eyes? Get back! Uh. Ah. Ah. Watch out for those bubbles! Ah. Digital strike! Stella! Wake up, please! Give me a few more minutes. What are you doing? You can't help them like this. What can I do? What can I do? Huh? There's got to be another way. Huh? Quick, let's hide while the anemones keep those villains busy. Let's try over there. Oh. Aisha, oh. look. Oh. oh no, they followed us here too. Don't be scared. The bad guys are gone. Everything's gonna be okay. Hmm. And you're safe from those nasty anemones in here, too. Hey, the huh? anemones are not nasty. They're Gorgol's natural defenses. They're only dangerous if they sense a threat. But Obscurum and the Star Yummies are gone. Why are they attacking us? Hmm. Well, first we hit Gorgol with our magic attacks. <gasps> and now the more we fight trying to get out, the more the anemones defend themselves. Hmm. I've got to fix this. Aisha, wait! <sighs> I gotta do something. I gotta do something. But what? Aisha, huh? wait for me!
anemones attack when they sense a threat. Hmm. <sighs> hey, my little friends. I need your help. <clears throat> These anemones love your music, don't they? Uh-huh. Mm, yeah. <sighs> Great. Could you give them something really beautiful to listen to? <laughs> <laughs> Never felt better. <gasps> hey, are they dancing? It's a dance of lights and colors. <laughs> There's only one thing left to do. Let's try to rekindle the core. But if we use our cosmics transformation, we can't breathe underwater. You may not believe this, but I've already thought it over. <laughs> and I think I've got the answer. It's full of air in here. That's right. We won't need our sirenics to breathe. This means that it's time for... Winx Cosmics! Let's go! Thanks, Aisha. You saved everyone. Bloom, Aisha, are you okay? Yes, we did it, Queen Lychia. Oh, it's beautiful. It's wonderful. <gasps> Gorgel is not a star like the others. It's alive! It's a starfish! Huh? <laughs> Gorgel is simply thanking you, Winx, for bringing back the light. <laughs> now, where does he come from? Uh, it's a long story. 
Time to go back to the party. I'd like to take another crack at that speech. Today, we celebrate the founding of Andros. <laughs> you know, nobody is perfect. We all make mistakes. Sometimes our anxieties run out of control. But even the dark hides a light, a light to guide us. And that light is love. As long as we on Andros stand united and care for one another, our star will never go out. Is it time? Is it finally time? I can't wait anymore. Yes, Twinkly, you've been very patient. One moment more. I just want to tell my daughter how proud her mother and I are of her. Mm. Your moment has come, Twinkly. You can begin the party. Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and now, party! <laughs> Great, Twinkly. You know how to go big. Beach. Thanks. And thanks for helping me when I needed you. Remember, I'll always be there for you, even when you don't want me to be. girl surprised me your nothingness it was a very difficult situation do you know what is vastly more difficult obscurum no your vileness what is it this mm. oh. <laughs> ah! Behold, Obscurum, that star is Hypsos. Oh, I've never seen such disgusting splendor, your darkness. <laughs> Very soon it will stop shining. For you will bring me its light. Uh, there is just one little problem. The same one as always, actually. The winks. Maybe we should add some incentive. Give a prize to whoever catches them. Silence, <laughs> Obscurum! I have big plans for our little problem. See the constellation of the Hydra? That's where Hypsos is. The constellation of the Hydra. Of, 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 of course. Uh, just, uh, oh. oh. Where is it? Can you see it? You know what a Hydra is, don't you, Obscurum? Yes, yes, your malignity. I don't have the faintest idea. Have any of you heard of it? Don't worry. Uh -huh. You'll find out very soon. <laughs> and so will the Wicks. <laughs> <laughs> 